24 nice instead one. of 18. How much? 24 instead of 18. That's 33% better. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Everything on an aircraft must have a reason. Ignore the status quo, imagine from scratch, and build what you can justify with science. Fail five times to succeed once. This is how we innovate paramotors, and for you, understanding the science behind will make you a smarter pilot. Here we are back in the field. This is the variomatic prop. This is the only one prototype existing in the world. It's the first in-flight adjustable propeller for paramotors. It changes the pitch from 10 to 13 degrees and it does it fully automatically based on the RPM in the air. So the idea is that I will take off with 10 degrees, which is the standard setting, and in the air, when I release the throttle and go somewhere into the mid-range for level flight, it will change automatically to 13 degrees, and it is expected to save 33% of fuel. Why I'm saying that? Because I tried before the similar prop with the same profile, same settings, but it was fixed, ground adjustable. Well, that meant that last time I was really running fast because with 13 degrees I didn't have much thrust and it, it was a difficult takeoff. But once I managed it, I could really enjoy the fuel saving. Now, this does both. So it goes to 10 degrees on the, during the takeoff phase, so I will have the full thrust just like with that prop. And in the air, it will change automatically into 13 degrees for level flight. That means I, could, I will save fuel. Now how will we measure that? So here we install the bottle. So once I take off, I will open that valve and that will stop suction from, of the fuel from the main tank and it will start sucking fuel from here. In that moment I will start a stopwatch and simply measure how many minutes and seconds will it take to consume fuel in this bottle and the engine to stop. Then I will glide down, install this prop and do the same experiment again and we will compare the numbers. It is expected that I will stay roughly 33% longer in the air with this propeller. Wish me luck. What 24 nice instead one. of 18. How much? 24 instead of 18. That's 33% better. Thank I suck the fuel to all the way. Yes. I don't yes, think there's yes, anything yes. left. No, no, so, no. and it was all the way to the cap. Yeah. So the measurement is absolutely precise. And it was 24 minutes and 14 seconds. And it was 18 minutes and 20 seconds. So it's basically 24 instead of 18. 33 fucking person better than than the regular prop. Ooh, Stefan. Yeah, I'm good. Oh, good, we did it. Uh, it's a lot quieter. Climb rate, good. So, conclusions on the consumption test. This bottle has 1.37 liters of fuel because we filled it all the way in the cap and I measured also the fuel in the fuel hose. So, with that, 
It means that my standard fuel consumption with a standard black propeller was 4.48, which totally meets my usual fuel consumption I'm having. With the white propeller, however, it was 3.39. Wow, I've never, never, ever had such low fuel consumption. It's a dream, but these numbers are totally irrelevant for you. The conclusion for you is that with your paramotor equipment, the Monster engine, with your glider, your weights, your altitude, your carburetor setting, if you would take this propeller, you will most likely be able to stay 33% longer in the air. Now question what comes next. I'm really grateful for the feedback we received from the paramotor community that the video introducing this propeller had 30,000 views within a week, which is huge success for, for a very technical video. We received lots of comments. In the next video, I would like to give answers to the, to the questions in those comments. Also, next week, I'm going to visit Dushan, our propeller guy, and Adrian, our CNC machining guy, to discuss serial production. So after that meeting, I will know a bit more about eventual availability of that propeller in the future guys thank you very much for your support and positive feedback i'm super excited about this about this project see you soon let's do a selfie <laughs>